Of course, we have so many Revenge fans on Twitter and on Facebook and on the interwebs in general. And we have Eisler here. So we're not letting Eisler leave so we can take your questions. Yay. So what questions we got, Kim? Well, we got Lynette Eberts says, love your accent. How fun to see you. Congrats on your award. Uh -huh. And what makes you compose such great music? <laughs> <laughs> what makes you do it? What makes me do it? What makes you such well, a genius? Um, oh, oh God. <laughs> um, what makes me do it? It's just a great show. You know, it's it's a good show to write for. I'm, I'm sorry that's a very inane answer, but it, it's uh, it's really it's well written. It's just fun. And what is fun about it is that it's so super dramatic that you get to do these very sort of broad strokes. And and the fact that we use a live orchestra, you know. I sort of know what I can write for them and what they're capable of doing, and they're capable of doing just about anything. So it's, uh, you know, I hope that answers that. Someone, someone it does right. answer that. Yeah. And we also have Edgar. Don't even try. Gerbellini. Wow, not bad. Mm -hmm. And he he wants to know how you keep up with the fan love. The, uh, the <laughs> revenge, the revenge fan yeah. love. I've got mad Twitter fingers. Mad Twitter Mad fingers, Twitter mate. Twitter fingers. That's what it is, Edgar. Now, uh, uh, actually, I've got to say, the, the Revenge fans, of, I mean, of all the stuff that I've worked on, the Revenge fans are amazing. Like, literally, every time that show goes out, the Twitter feed just blows up. And, and, it, and the actors are really act active in it as well. Um, uh, Gabriel Mann, in particular, gets on, and, and Ashley gets on, and, the, and they just tweet the hell out of it and I think Gabe was saying like you know they should be the, the ABC publicity department at some point they just like Twitter up and the fans really like talking about the show the crazy thing is though it's like are you watching the show or are you tweeting about it because they're doing it all at the same time they're doing it at the same time yeah. I think also people love watching it together right so it's a level of multitasking and I don't have and inter interacting well no because you're conducting the orchestra or something well not when the show's on not well you know tweeting you're about it. I'm like this <laughs> Two, three, four, Edgar. And yes. Buzz, and Buzzworthy Radio wants to know if you would ever wear that kilt again in the not too distant future. All right, first of all, may I say, I know who you are, Ooh. Novell. You cheeky bugger, right? <laughs> you a cheeky bugger. <laughs> and uh, that's actually a term of endearment. No, I, I know who that is. Novell is, uh, is we affectionately call the, uh, the, the voice of the revenge underground. Ooh. He's, Ooh. Ooh, ooh, well, I never. And he's, um, he is a very big fan of the show. And uh, how do, what was the question? Other than him being Are you, you, you going to rock the kilt again? Okay, am I allowed to swear on the show? Yes. Fuck no. <laughs> he's done with his time. I'm a grown up. Quotes. Ish. Grown ups so, were killed. Sort of. Sort of. Yeah. Like that very likely. Yeah. Yeah. Very <laughs> likely. On Twitter. For you. <laughs> <laughs> Um, and last question, we have Dave, Friends fan, who wants to know if you prefer scoring movies or TV shows. Ooh, uh, very different reasons. I love both of them. I mean, the TV is very immediate, and it's very, but that makes it pretty brutal. That's like, if you're doing a show like Shameless, it's quick and it's fun and it's, you just sort of get on with it. If you're doing a show like Revenge, it's like scoring a movie every week. So that's kind of brutal, um, but I do. But rewarding. It is, it's very is rewarding. rewarding because also it's immediate. There's no hanging around. It's not like being in a band where it's like, well, we'll maybe be in a band for 10 years, then maybe get signed, and then maybe we'll go on the road, and then maybe, maybe, maybe. It's no, no, no. It's out on Wednesday. Deliver. Right. And so you, your first idea has got to be your best idea. And if it isn't, then you are screwed, basically. Well, it's also a good way for you to be operating an instinct all the time from coming from being yeah. in a rock band. And, and, right. and a touring musician, where you're constantly in that kind of interaction and not like closed off. Yeah, when I mean, I think it's, a, it's the most, right, in, in terms of, you know, writing for film and TV, where it's a very sort of, you know, you're sitting in your studio most of the time, really, sort of locked away, and there's no and daylight and all the rest of it. In my, in my kilt, <laughs> sweating profusely. <laughs> uh, uh, the, um, it's not true. Not true. Um, that, uh, wow. <laughs> we got distracted there. I totally forgot what I was talking about. I got, to, <laughs> I got to sweating profusely and I totally lost my thread there. I in was terms talking of about. The yeah, so the, the immediacy together. of the kilt, uh, <laughs> the immediacy of, of like having to get it out and having to get it done, and then the immediacy of being in front of an orchestra and conducting it and, right. and you know, and it being mixed the next day, and then it's on TV a week later, you know, there's no hanging around. 
So I do love that. Movies, I love for the opposite reason, that you get a little more time to, to experiment and to pour over ideas and, uh, and, to, you know, and to sort of get it wrong. And you, you have to get it wrong a few times to get it right eventually, I think, to be able to push the limits. Otherwise, you know, I could always reach into sort of the, the, the toolbox of stuff that I know works. And instead, it's worth trying to go a bit off base and getting it wrong in order to find something a bit different and a bit unique, you know. And, Okay. Well, well, thank, thank you, you again Eisler. for coming. And thank you to all the revenge fans. You Twitter people. And all the, all the you Twitter You revenge fans. tweets. And uh, we'll see you guys next week. Bye. Bye.